It might not look like it, but these people with orange bags on the side of the street are holding a memorial service. Two years ago, Chief Warrant Officer Fort Brent Cole was killed in action in Afghanistan while flying with the 1A2 Attack Reconnaissance Battalion. So the unit got the city of Fayetteville to dedicate this street and it's special in more ways than one. Andrews was picked, which was perfect because of uh, the location for uh, uh, where his church is, where his family goes to church, is right here on Andrews Avenue. And then it's on the way into the airfield as well. And even though there's less than a month till the next deployment, work and family were put off for a few special hours. Troopers that came out volunteered. They knew what it was for. They knew the reason why we were doing it. They did have other things that they could have been doing, but. A lot of the troopers that were here today actually knew him. Some of them flew with him, crew chiefed for him, spent time with him, or, or were there during that deployment. The bonds that soldiers build together continue and extend out to their families. For these soldiers, taking time out of their day is one way of showing the families that bonds are forever. The location is perfect because my husband traveled this road to go to work, and we attend the church here that the road is on. So every week, we of course are able to see the sign. We're very humbled and, and just extremely grateful that the unit would go to this much trouble for us. And with the unit headed back to a war zone, it's more important now than ever to let soldiers know they will not be forgotten should the worst happen. Reporting from Fayetteville, North Carolina, I'm Army Sergeant Donna Davis, Task Force Poseidon.